On August 31st, 1965, fans of super different airplanes could add another oddity to their list when the Aerospace Line's Super Guppy made its first flight. A bulbous-looking whale of an airplane, the Super Guppy was the successor to the Pregnant Guppy, an equally goofy-looking giant cargo plane. As said previously, the Super Guppy had been developed from the Pregnant Guppy, which in turn was based on the C-97 military cargo plane, itself based on the Boeing 377 airliner, which in turn was originally based on the B-29 Super Fortress bomber. It would appear Boeing got their money's worth out of the B-29 airframe, as it had also been used to develop the B-50 bomber and the KC-97 aerial tanker. Only five Super Guppies were ever built. Operated by NASA, their purpose was to move oversized cargo. Loading was done over the nose which would swing to the side to port to reveal the cavernous interior cargo bay. Later, Airbus bought the rights to the design and in 1982 and 1983, UTA Industries built two of these Bolumpus transports for France. Note, Bolumpus is an adjective made up especially for this article. One of these unusual planes is still in service with NASA in El Paso, Texas. The other four that were built are on display in France, Germany, England, and Tucson, Arizona. Powered by four turboprop engines and manned by a crew of four, the Super Guppy could fly at speeds of almost 300 miles per hour for almost 2,000 miles. The giant cargo bay measured 25 by 25 by 111 feet, and total cargo weight was just over 54,000 pounds. Certainly a special airplane that had been built for special purposes. This curiosity has since been replaced by even larger jet-powered transports. Still, looking at it, one must wonder how such a bulbous plane was ever able to stay in the air, or, for that matter, get off the ground. So... What are some of your favorite airplane oddities? Please let us know in the comments to this video. And if you like this video and would like to receive notification of new videos, please feel welcome to subscribe to History and Headlines. Your viewership is much appreciated.